Hi, this is Alejandro from Esparajo Madrid and I'm going to show you a really nice five bedroom apartment. It is located in Calle Santa Cruz de Marcenado, which is next to San Bernardo Metro Station. It's one of the best areas to live. You're next to Calle Alberto Aguilera, Arguelles neighborhood, uh, Quevedo, Bilbao, Malasaña. Uh, you can walk everywhere. It's a really nice area and let's take a look. Okay, so I'm only going to be able to show you one of the five bedrooms, uh, which is this one right here next to the main door of the apartment. And as we get in, the, on the left we have the bedroom, bedroom number one I'm going to show you and then a really long corridor with the rest of the rooms and then on the left we have the kitchen and living room. And first I'll show you this bedroom. Every single bedroom has a private bathroom like this one. Okay, and first, okay, let's take a look around. Uh, there's some stuff because people are living here right now so you, you can get the idea of all the space you would have with like stuff in the middle of your stuff like some clothes uh, the desk here some stuff all right so first we have heating units uh, we have central heating which is really nice also air conditioning unit up there and uh, a standalone closet right here like a wardrobe here where you can hang your clothes, desk, and all right, double bed over there. It's a really big bedroom. A nightstand right there next to the bed. And let's take a look from here too. All right, so here we have that again, uh, the hanger or the wardrobe for the clothes, TV and some drawers over there. This is an interior patio view, okay. But the apartment is exterior, you have a really nice terrace uh, in the living room, I'll show you in a minute. And, okay, now let's take a look at the bathroom. And, all right. So here we have the shower. mirror right there sink toilet and heating unit this is the same interior patio view you just saw and now we're going this way here you have some more space more uh, standalone closet here we have another bedroom which would be number two three here we have four five and uh, it's just rack with some clothes that I just put here because it was in the living room and I wanted to show you the living room without like anything in the middle and let's take a look at this kitchen living room space which is really nice really big and uh, they both are connected which I really like when the kitchen and the living room are connected and all right so first let's show you this area the kitchen and all right so here we have this really big table with a bunch of chairs and let's take a closer look to what we have in the kitchen it's fully equipped and uh, there you have one fridge another one right there oven and microwave some cabinets here, it's a really nice kitchen, a stove and sink and then here we have toaster, a uh, really nice coffee maker and dishwasher right here, washing machine with dryer function also here which is really nice and let's open some uh, cabinets and drawers, here we have a lot of pans and pots, alright and cutlery and here's some cabinets for your food plates glasses all kinds of stuff all right really nice all right so you get the idea some space for your food and now living room area Let's take a look from here. Alright, so T 
TV over there and TV stand with some drawers, chair right here, and we have this t big table here in the middle with these two couches or sofas. All right, really nice. Air conditioning unit over there and heating unit, another rack to dry your clothes and look from here and then we'll go outside and I'll show you the terrace which is really nice but right now today it's like a cloudy day kind of rainy and let's show you this really nice table and uh, this terrace connects with the bedroom bedroom number five uh, next to this living room and this is the view that you have really nice area and all right that's it well thanks for watching this is alejandro from Esparajo, madrid hope you liked it and see you next time bye